Okay, uh, my name is Roy Albertson. I'm a industrial arts teacher here at Gobby High School. Uh, my students have built this house behind me. Uh, it's been about a year. We've been on this house for about one year. And uh, it's going to be moved to Monticello. Uh, we have a lady that's handicapped in Monticello that's going to get this house. Uh, she is a graduate of Gobby, a former graduate, so that's kind of nice. And uh, we'll be starting a new house real soon. Hello, my name is Norshawn Washington. I'm in the 12th grade. I started um, into this program last year. I got in um, the second semester of last year because I didn't want to do anything else. I decided, oh, construction would be nice. So I decided to get into construction. So we started building the house from ground up and we stabilized the house so it won't move anywhere. Every, it was nice. I also got a picture. We, um, we got on top of the house and we took a picture on top of the house from when we started. So it looks very nice now. Um, it was great because I've never been in anything like that. So I can now look at the house and see that I was a part of building it, putting the nails in, putting the walls in, boards up and stuff like that. It was very nice. Well, what I, I really learned, I learned how to fill holes and I never learned, I never knew that in my day in my life. Thanks to Mr. Help. This is a great opportunity for our students to learn real world skills in developing um, workforce readiness. In addition, it's a tremendous partnership between uh, the Leon County Public Schools and Goodwill Industries. A tremendous family is going to be getting a wonderful home just in time for the holidays and I couldn't be more proud of our school community. It takes us about a year to build the house. Um, I've got three classes right now that work on it every day. Um, we do everything from the ground up. Now we have help from um, Lively comes over and does the electrical for us. Their classes do that for us. They have an electrician class that comes over here and does the wiring. The county helped us with the plumbing. They did the plumbing work, but all the kids can still work with the people that come out and work on the house. Uh, we had uh, Parker Brothers came and did the AC. We don't do the AC. But everything else we did, we built the cabinets, uh, we hired somebody to do the sheetrock and do that, but we still fin did all the finished work in the house. We built the cabinets, did the shingles, uh, did the vinyl on the outside. So we do pretty much everything. When I first got into class, we started off as doing like math problems and stuff, like how to lay sheetrock and stuff like that. Like we learned, we learned how to be, do the stuff first, and then we applied it to the house once we got to the house. The value of the project is immeasurable, pardon the pun. Um, the issue is that um, you know, students learn math skills, geometry. Uh, as we know with high stakes testing that are coming online this year, um, those kinds of math skills are a critical part of their ability to graduate high school. And not only that, they get uh, the team building component that is so much a part of the workforce experience today. They learn that they are all working together for something bigger than themselves. And that's an incredible part of not only the explicit curriculum we teach at Gobby, but also the implicit curriculum that is part of going to school. 